Hi guys, welcome back to another what's in my bag video and this time it's going to be what I am using in April. This is a bag that I really really love because it is so beautiful with all the flowers and I always use it during summer and springtime because it gives me that springy sort of um, atmosphere and I really love it. Um, I remember just seeing this bag in the window, it was on a Sunday, and I told my friend that I really really want it and I couldn't go and get it um, the following Monday, so um, I remember spending almost a whole day just telling him, please just go get it for me, get it for me because I can't go on Monday and I really, really want that bag. And it was such a beautiful surprise when I got it. Um, and it's a very spacious bag, although it may seem um, a little small for the usual bags that I use, but um, it ended up being so spacious and I really love it. Um, I have been using it for the last week. Um, during April, I uh, have changed, I think, three or four bags and this is the one that I am using and I decided that I was going to film um, the what's in my bag for April um, using this bag because um, I think I will be using it for quite a bunch of weeks. Um, whenever I started using this bag, I basically ended up using it for many, many weeks and I think for this time, this is the first time I'm using it in 2018. I think I will do that also this time here. So let's dig into it and let's see what I have. So as I said, it's a very beautiful bag. In my opinion, it has these very colorful and beautiful flowers. Um, it has two um, straps like this and it takes also another long uh, one which can be um, put on these d-rings but I never use that because I find it that it squashes a little bit the bag and I don't like that so it opens up through this one here this opening and it has also a zip here and when you open it up you can see all my contents yeah there is a lot there's a lot but for all of you that have been following me and watching all my what's in my bag videos they know that i do have a lot of things in my bag and i need these things to be with me on a daily basis so i'm not going to go any further and continue saying the same things as i said in the previous what's in my bag videos but basically whatever i have in here is something which for me is so much important um, to carry on a daily basis because I spend a lot of hours out of the house and I need these things to be with me. So the first thing is my wallet. So this is what I'm using. It's a rose gold wallet. And then I do have two sunglass pockets because I'm trying to use some of my sunglasses. Um, I have so many sunglasses and I think I really need to start using them because I find that I do purchase sunglasses, I like them in that moment and then I just put them on my shelf and don't use them. So I'm trying to keep two sunglasses at a time, one in the aviator style and one in another style and this is just another pair of sunglasses as you can see. Um, they are different from the aviators one but um, and I'm keeping them in these flowery pockets just to keep up with the theme of the bag. So this is the first pair of sunglasses and then I have my aviator ones. These are big aviator ones and I love big aviator um, sunglasses. And the pockets, they are the same. I've got them from Peacocks and I really love them. I really love the products from this shop. So then I have my usual Zenies. Um, these are my prescription glasses. They are the purple ones and I think I have shown you these um prescription glasses already before this is what i've got they are large and they are purple for instance they are always purple the ones that i have and then i have my foldable bag 
I've been using this. This is the second year that I have been using this. I have another one in purple. It's a very large bag. You can see it. It is big and many of the times it's a lifesaver for me because um, I just end up going doing some purchases um, that are actually unplanned and today not many of the shops give you bags not everyone um, and whenever I have things to carry or by the way I might end up changing my shoes from the heel ones to my flat ones because sometimes I do have them my heel shoes end up in this bag so this is a lifesaver for me whenever I go shopping which is unplanned and I need the bag or else when I need to change my shoes because I get tired on heels on an eight hour or more anyways this is my pack of tissues you have seen this I think for the past two or three years in all my what's in my bag videos it's holding very well I had to repair it a little bit with tape but it's still holding up then I've got my chili okay my chili wet wipes intimate wipes I find these very good for my bag because they are compact they are small and they are very good too um, I have this pocket here I think it features in a video where I have all my phone cords and all the things just organized and kept there my headphones yeah that's it and it has this cute little tassel oh it has something we'll clean it up later but anyways this is the pocket I decided to just keep all the cords together because I had so many things going around in my bag and I as you can see I just love a very organized bag and I don't want to keep anything which is going around in my bag it gives me anxiety this is the pocket where I do keep what do I have something to clean up my phone the usual wet wipes to clean my phone and then I have this pocket which usually holds my phone in it and in this one I have some more cords another pair of headphones why do I have two I don't know anyways yeah but I need that um, this is my makeup pocket this is what I'm having what I'm keeping it's the usual makeup pocket it's the usual contents that I have been um, showing you multiple times a lot of times this is what I've got in my perfumes some clips etc but it's so cute it's compact it's small and it says pink motel yeah that fits me perfectly because everything is pink I love it because it's small as you can see in my hand it's really small but the shape of it it just keeps everything very well compact um, I will have the links down below to the things that I am showing you that maybe you can get from the internet and um, I hope if you like them you can get them this is my it says beauty like the dream and it has a pocket here where I do have paper clips and some page flex and then I've got the usual things here my highlighters my stationery my pens the usual things there I have page flags I have my white tape my correction tape pair of scissors my usb sharpener a bunch of things like i usually show you so i do have quite a lot of things over there and oh by the way i love this i have been carrying this lately quite a lot i'm finishing up my apartment hopefully it will be finished completely this year Oh, I have been mentioning this for so many times, but anyways, so everywhere I go, I'm going around with a measuring tape, as you can see. I got it from Zara. I got it from Zara Home and yeah, the section where they do sell um, home things, house things, whatever, home furnishings, I think. Um, 
yeah i've been going around with that for a very very long time now it's been the moment i will get it out the moment will be that moment will be when i have finished completely my house and i will be happy anyways this is my stationery pocket and there will be a link down below even to this one what else my usual brush i hope it's not dirty no um it's from kent it's an anti-static tan i love it because it folds and it stays wherever i want it to be my current file effects the geometric and the personal size and i have also the matching notebook which i keep in my work briefcase there will be a video about the planner and the planner lineup for 2018 i just moved into it yesterday so yeah i love it i love to be matching my notebook to my personal planner the contents remain the same as they were before so yeah that's it there's nothing in the pockets here um then i've got my walking pharmacy essential pouch i did change the pouch i got this from new look yeah that's where i got it i think i purchased it two months ago and i ended up leaving it in a bag and not using it and then i think two weeks ago i found it so yeah that's it it holds everything it usually has the usual things i have been showing you a million and one times my headache relief balm my medicines my shea butter scent hand cream from essence etc etc the usual things that i have been showing you in all my what's in my bag videos and as i usually say if this essential pocket does not fit in the bag it's not the pocket which is moving but it's the bag it's going to be changed that's what i say always and that's what i keep up with next i have changed my card my loyalty card um pocket i hope i hope i have not flashed my credit cards and a bunch of other papers so I did change this pocket and I moved into this. It's a little bit chunky, but even my cards are getting chunkier. I think I need to review that. Then I have another one. Um, you can ride with us. It's a unicorn pouch. I got it from New Look three weeks ago. It was on sale. Yeah, I got it from New Look, but I removed all the tags. And you know, all that jewelry when I said it already in the past video, um, you know that jewelry when it pisses you off and you need to remove it that's where it goes and I think I did not use it properly yesterday because I removed my here they should be if I did not lose them now they are here I did remove my earrings yesterday and where is the other one this is my earring but I have another one it's here and yeah i did not use the pocket properly for the reason it was in my bag this is my perfume um it's a portable perfume it doesn't it's unbranded but i like the scent and i keep it in my bag and this is for my refreshing eye drops because i'm always and a whole day in front of my computer and the last thing that there is in this bag is my orbit peppermint chewing gum that's what I've got and there's nothing you can see there's nothing here but let's see whether there is something at the back because I think there should be yes my usual wet wipes my companions my hankies my favorite ones and then I've got some beauty formulas feminine uh, intimate hygiene wipes more yeah I'm full of wipes but that's what I've got in my bag. You can see what I've got there. I've got quite a lot of things. And when I say a lot, a lot. But as usual, I cannot for no reason live without these during my daily work. Day or weekday. When I'm in during the weekend, I usually do remove some of the things. But when I'm in this bag, it will end up coming with me even during the weekend but anyways maybe the planner gets removed because i don't need it 
but the rest will come with me. Ah, even this one will get removed during the weekend, but that's it. So, I hope that you have liked this video. This is the April update for the What's in My Bag series. Um, so I will see you next time when I will be filming the What's in My Bag for May. Hopefully there will be some different contents because I'm thinking about changing once again my pockets, but you will see it back then. So, anyways, take care. Don't forget to subscribe and to like this video. And as usual, if you need to get in contact, there's Facebook, Pinterest, Instagram, and email. So do send me whatever you want to. Anyways, take care and bye.